We turn now to a deeply troubling headline tonight about the young American woman, Kayla Mueller, the honor student from Arizona, an aid worker in Syria, kidnapped by ISIS. Her death reported last February. Tonight here, the chilling new revelation about her life as a hostage. Her parents speaking to ABC News tonight and Chief Global Affairs correspondent Martha Raddatz reporting in. Tonight, horrific new information about life in captivity for Kayla Mueller, the young woman from Arizona held by ISIS for more than a year and a half. Counterterrorism officials tell ABC News Kayla was repeatedly raped by the top leader of ISIS, al-Baghdadi, one of the world's most wanted terrorists. Her parents confirmed to ABC News that U.S. officials gave them similar information. The daughter and star student went to Syria to work with war refugees. I am in solidarity with the Syrian people. Her family later sharing details from a letter Kayla wrote in captivity, I will not give in no matter how long it takes. But after a failed U.S. rescue effort, time eventually ran out. The circumstances of her death still unclear. Friends and family creating this tribute video. I will always love you. It's never goodbye among friends. She would have been 27 today, Martha, as you were reporting earlier. And in the meantime, you've learned more from the family tonight? Well, the family says they were told that al-Baghdadi made repeated visits to the compound, David, where Kayla was held. Just a horrible details, Martha. Thank you, and we'll be watching you on Sunday morning.